Good morning, Ted. Great morning. How are you doing? Good. What will you be showing us today? One of our many Salem's by Forest River, built right here in the Northwest for the Northwest. Follow me. I'll show you a few features. First, a full pass-through front storage, uh, accessible from the outside or the inside. Four heavy-duty exterior stabilizing jacks. 12-volt clearance lenses, uh, so nobody's going to smack into you. <laughs> Uh, almost a full-size exterior awning, uh, so if it rains here in Washington State, you can be dry. 12-volt uh, exterior light with an amber lens to keep the bugs away and also have it nice and bright out here when you're barbecuing. Um, exterior 110 outlets as well. Um, great for uh, 110 barbecues, uh, exterior lights, etc., uh, etc. Et Next, we have a heavy-duty 4x4 uh, bumper, uh, bike racks. You can fit about anything you like on there. It's uh, welded right to the frame. Um, we have our uh, exterior city water inlet, so if you're at a park, you can hook right up to the city water. Or if you go out in the middle of the mountains, um, we have our fresh tank fill. Um, both very easy accessible here. Um, escape window. If you ever have to jump out of this thing, it's easy accessible from the rear. Um, more 12 volt lighting. Again, very visible at nighttime. Um, the second exterior storage, which is uh, very unique for a 22 foot trailer. Um, fully vinyled, um, the whole trailer from front to back. As you can see, Salem does color coat all of their water lines for hot and cold. Also have very easy accessible winterization valves for the do-it-yourselfers. Next is our uh, hot water tank here. Um, it's the upgraded tank, so it's a six gallon, but it's a gas and electric. Um, if you're at a park, you can use their power. If you're in the middle of the woods, you can use your propane. Um, it's direct spark ignition, so there's really nothing you need to do outside here. It's got a push button inside the kitchen. Um, we'll show you that in the inside. Uh, next is going to be your 30 amp power cord, uh, about a 20 foot cord. That comes with every Salem travel trailer. Um, again, heavy duty for your air conditioner, microwave, um, all the accessories that comes with them. The other side of your pass through storage here for uh, fishing poles, lawn chairs, wood, uh, anything you need to take camping. Exterior 12 volt battery, uh, which mostly everything on here is 12 volt powered. Um, and an enclosed box here to protect it from the weather. Uh, two five gallon propane tanks, uh, which will last you quite a while. Uh, most of the season in the summertime, a little, use a little more in the winter. Another exterior 12 volt light. Uh, they're not shy on these. Again, if you're hooking up at nighttime or, or, or camping at night, easy. Uh, light, light this all up real nice. Uh, but those are just a few of the exterior features of this 22 foot Salem uh, Travel Treader by Forest River. Hey Ted, what kind of interior features does this have? It's got tons. Uh, before I show you all the interior features, what I'd like to point out is a few things you can't see. Um, number one is the roof system. Uh, the Salem's, uh, exclusively built here in the Northwest, have a five inch trust roof. Um, so it's kind of like a home. It's got a radius roof to it. Uh, it does a couple of things. Number one, it's fully walkable. Uh, number two, it, there's no way for water, residual water to sit up there and pool up on you. It'll always run off. Um, another nice feature, a part of the Northwest package, is double insulation, which is very important in our time, our, our part of the country here. Um, all the doors and windows have metal stra uh, straps around all the stress points, so they're never going to separate on you over time. Uh, same with the windows. Um, the floors have two by fours, ten inches on center. Um, the walls are sixteen inches on center. Um, a lot of Brand X out there are forty-eight, um, so on and so forth. Uh, so again, built in the Northwest for the Northwest, very rugged. Um, on top of the things you can't see, um, some of the nice features, these guys have standard uh, built-in CD player, AM, FM, um, nice sound, uh, four speakers, two in front, two in back. Um, the TV antenna here will get you all your local stations, uh, 7, 13, 4, um, so if you're out there and you have a, a clear view and not too many big trees right in front of you, you get some local channels here. Um, abundant storage, again, you know, these guys are made for camping, these aren't just made for, you know, going playing in the yard, these are made to go out in the woods. Um, tons of storage, deep cabinets, all screwed, glued in from the outside. So very heavy duty, not going to fall off on you down the road. Um, come on in. Uh, these guys have a very heavy duty uh, 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 furnace here. It's ther thermostatically controlled. So you set that furnace at 65, 70 degrees. It'll keep you nice and warm and toasty in here. Um, air conditioner along the same lines here. Um, real easy to operate, on off. Um, 13,500 BTUs of air conditioning. So a little overkill, but you got those hot days, hey, why not? It'll cool you down like that. Um, on the outside, when I was showing you the hot water heater, this is what I was referring to as the switch on the inside for the DSI, a direct spark ignition. So whether you're running 110 or propane, 
hit that button, it fires your hot water. Um, you have it directly right here. Um, water pump, again, if you're um, going off of your own water tank in the middle of the woods, turn that on, you have direct water pressure, all 12 volts. Runs right off that battery I showed you out front. Um, deep sinks, uh, great for washing dishes. Again, abundant storage, uh, pots and pans, uh, silverware, extra uh, pantries here, uh, under sink storage, uh, coat closets. Uh, this particular model here can sleep quite a few. It's got a dinette that drops down to approximately a twin size bed. Uh, the front sofa also will pull out to approximately a twin size bed here. Uh, perfect for an adult or a couple of uh, children. On uh, the back's got a corner double size bed uh, for the couple, a bunk above. Um, some folks use this as storage. Uh, if you take the cushion out, it's actually got a nice lip. Um, we have quite a few customers that store their dog kennels up here or uh, any items that you don't want falling off. Uh, real convenient. As you can see, the abundance of 12 volt lighting. Um, so again, we're in, we are in the Northwest. Um, these guys do have a, a tinted window to protect your fabrics. So it can get a little dark in here if you don't have the proper, proper lighting. Uh, these guys do. Uh, they put it everywhere. So it's never gonna be dark in here. Um, come on to the bathroom. Again, we're in a 22 foot trailer. You have to keep in mind, a lot of my competitors, um, a guy my size can't even sit in the toilet. Um, no problem. I can sit here, a guy probably twice my size can sit here and still have a foot of room in front of him. Um, so again, something to look for when you're shopping for a travel trader. Uh, there's some bathrooms I can't sit in. Um, so, nice room. 12 volt fan. Um, you ever want to get ventilation. Standard. Uh, hot and cold water shower with a small mini bathtub. Kids love it. No weight limit. So I think that about sums it up um, for the interior features of the Salem Travel Trader uh, built right here in the Northwest. Um, I really suggest you guys come down and check us out. Uh, something like this here with approximately 10% down, you're looking at probably $155 a month. Uh, very affordable. Um, come and see us here at South Hill RV Sales.